you're not, you're so fancy, girl. You're so fancy. I'm not done yet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so how'd it go with her? That's what you came over here for, isn't it? <laughs> well, it didn't go good. Yeah. You did the right thing. Look, I get it. People don't like it when you talk about their children. You told her right. I know I did. I just hope she gets it, though. What I know about her, she a smart girl. When she thinks about things, she comes around. I hope she will. Speaking of not so smart... What? Your husband. What is he doing? You been out to your garage? No. You need to. I'm afraid to. He's out there trying to fix those dryers on his own. Joe, I'm telling you. Curtis is going to burn this place down. I know it. OK, I better call the professionals. You know, that's not a bad idea. Right. Listen, why don't you let me know when Ryan is available to keep Curtis busy so that I can get some professionals to come over here and look at this work? Um, OK. And where is Ryan? Oh, he's studying. He's got exams coming up. Oh, I remember those times with Calvin. <laughs> <laughs> what time is that, baby? You know, Curtis, the times when he was studying for those exams. <laughs> Please. Calvin ain't never studied for nothing. Curtis, uh, why are you dressed like this? Dressed like what? Oh, I don't know. A helmet with a light. Goggles. One glove. <laughs> don't act like you ain't never seen this before. Curtis, what are you doing out there in that garage? I'm just cleaning up. And fixing a few things for repairs. Well, why are you out there so long, Curtis, every day? That garage is so dirty. <laughs> dirty, baby! Okay. Well, good. I'm glad you're cleaning it up, Curtis, because I want to put my car in that garage. Well, you know it's a one-car garage, right? <laughs> and I only have one car. That's so cold, though. What? What do I do with my car? Put it in the driveway like you usually do. One of these days, Ella. One of these days. Right! working on that place. Oh, they all dead. <laughs> well, that's no help. No, I seem to remember someone. Terrence is his name. Uh-huh. I think he's he's still in the repair business. OK. Well, is he experienced? In what? <laughs> Repairs, maintenance. I couldn't tell you. <laughs> hmm. Well, can you get me a number? OK, I will. I got that little black book somewhere. <laughs> Listen, about Nyla. In time, she'll know that you meant her no harm. I hope she does. She will. Good. I brought you some lunch. Oh, I'm sorry. I just don't have time to eat that right now. OK. Yeah. Well, I'll just, I'll just leave it over here. OK. Nyla. Look, sorry, Miss Ella. I'm not ready to talk about it, OK? OK. Thank you. OK. I won't push. I appreciate it.
See you later. I won't push, but you're staying at my house. <laughs> hey! 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 This is Terrence. Hey! hey. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is one of the sons that helped Uncle Robert strong and strapping. <laughs> so, I hear you need my help. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. OK, so do you want me to come to the laundromat? I'd love to see it. No, 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 no. Okay, then how am I supposed to know what I'm doing? Sorry. <laughs> you see, my husband, Curtis, is a butthole. <laughs> Sorry, I am. Joanne! <laughs> Curtis has decided that he wants to do all of the repairs all by himself. Oh, really? Is he any good at it? Mm, not at all. Yeah, that may be a problem. I know. You tell me. <laughs> I'm married to him. I'll put you on my prayer list. <laughs> so I was wondering if I could take you by there so that you can see it when he's not around. Sure. Yes. Here is my card. OK. You can just call me when you're ready to do that. OK, good. Contracted by Terrence. That's me. No last name. <laughs> Well, it was nice meeting you. It's Ella. a pleasure meeting you. Thank you. No problem. <laughs> Bye, Miss Joanne. <laughs> Ain't had no card when I met him. So, Ella, I think that he can be of help. Yeah, I do too. Mm -hmm. But not with my relationship with mm, Nyla. Well, as I said, give it time. I will. You know I won't push. Mm, that's what they tell me. So, what's going on here? How can I help? Well, I got the kids in the back. Oh, Well, you know I love the kids. <laughs> Come on. I mean, I love the kids. <laughs> little girls and little boys. <laughs> I'll do whatever I have to for the kids. Nala, hey. What are you doing here? I wanted to apologize to you. I don't want to hear it. Well, I just, you know, I wanted to say that it's really wrong what I did. All of it was wrong. Yes, all of it. All of it was wrong. Well, that's my daughter. I know. And she's a kid. I know. And I've been feeling terrible ever since I found out. I, I'm saying I've been feeling terrible, too. Why do you feel bad? You did it. Well, this anger management program, it has me, you know, being accountable for my actions and seeing that. You know, I've hurt people. I've hurt you. I can't check up. No, I, I mean, baby, look, this is, this is different for me, isn't it? Kendrick, I don't think. Isn't it? Yes. You know, I, I, I mean, I, I never cared before. I know. So, I, I mean, look, why don't we, why don't we just go to dinner? You know, we could talk, talk about it. I don't think that's gonna happen. Why not? I'm trying to deal with helping my kids, okay? I don't have time or space for you. Baby, I, I still love you. I still love you. I think you should leave. Okay. Okay. Okay, I, I'll, I'll leave. Nala, I'm sorry. Bye. <laughs> Nyla? Yeah. Was that Kendrick? Yeah. What did he want? Nothing. He just wanted to talk. Oh. You, you know. sure? Yeah. 
okay. having fun yet? Yeah, give me all the money out your pockets, too. You're out of luck, buddy. You too, kid. You know what this means? You gotta do good in school. That I can do. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Mama. Hi. Mama, we had cake. Oh, I'm sure it was good. But Uncle Curtis got the biggest piece. Little snitch. <laughs> Did you eat? No, I can't eat. Okay. Do go eat. Miss Ella, can we talk? Uh, yes, we can. Come on. Uh, where are you going? This sound like it's gonna cost me some more money. Sit down. And more house guests. <laughs> I'm serious, Ellen. You come out of that kitchen with a receipt and another two or three, four kids, it's gonna be a problem. <laughs> Give me that money. Would you care for some coffee, tea? No, thanks. Okay. Just wanna talk. Okay. Sit down. What is it? First, I want to say that I am so sorry. Oh, okay. It's okay. <laughs> I thought you were going to say, I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. <laughs> and um, I found out that he did have a rat. How did you find out? I talked to him. Nyla. Yeah. And he said it was just a lab rat from work and that it was just a little white mouse. Lynn told me it was a white mouse. I can't believe I didn't know. Listen, you just need to believe your child. I'm gonna try and do that. No, let's just do it. I don't know how. You will figure that out. How? My mother never did it for me. Mothering does not come with a handbook. We just get up every day and do the best we can. Sometimes we get it right and sometimes we don't. If we don't get it right, we just get up the next day, try to do a little better. But if you follow your heart, it will always lead you the right way. Now, I know your mother never did it for you. You told me. But it's your turn now. Why don't you do the opposite? What she didn't do, you do. No more pity parties. Uh, no, no pity party. This is not a pity party, but how am I supposed to know that? OK. You see that little girl over there? She's a little young, grown up. Talk to her like you talk to me. She is so smart, both of them, so smart. You've done a good job. You've done a good job. <laughs> you want to tell them right now? Oh, no. Oh, yeah. No, I'm not. I, 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 oh, oh, yeah. You can do it right now. <laughs> I'll go get it. OK. <laughs> What are you doing? I said, man, it's painting, baby. Curtis. Really, that's, I never noticed it. <laughs> Go sit down, baby. I told him. Lynn, Kenny, your mama wants to see you. Aww. Are we leaving? No, you're not leaving. Aww. Curtis. Then why she want to talk to us? <laughs> 
Just go and see. Come on. Let's go hear the bad news. It's not always bad news. Yes, it is. When we sit down with our mama. <laughs> there it is! Baby, that was cold. I mean it. I mean it. Okay. Come on. Come on. Let's go see what's going on. Man, he really didn't want to go in there, did he? Curtis. <laughs> you really need to stop it. Ella, you really know that was funny. This is serious. This is so sad. Okay, okay, baby. <laughs> why do I even talk? I mean, well, why do I even talk to you? That's sad. Yeah. So you can't tell me to be sad. Hey. Hi. I want to talk to you. What's this about? Are we in trouble? No. No. And we're not moving? No. No. Good. <laughs> so you like it here? Yeah. Well, except for that old man. Getting my nerves. Let it be quiet. No, that old man can hear you. What's going on? I want to talk to you about Kendrick. He not back in the picture, is he? No. Why do people say back in the picture? Be quiet, Lynn. But what does it mean? It means he's not back in our lives. Oh, good. <laughs> but what he did is still affecting us. What does that mean? You're having nightmares. It's OK. No, it is not. Because it's ruining my sleep. Oh, Lord, you sound like Uncle Curtis already. I can't. <laughs> We're going to have to fix that. Um, but baby, I didn't know that mouse was in that room. It's OK. No, baby, it's not OK. It's not. And you know what? I don't want you to grow up and be like your mom. I want you to grow up and be strong and free and not let anything hold you back. We know that. You do? Yeah. I don't want you to ever doubt that. Do you know it, Lynn? Know what? That I want the best for you? Sometimes. Oh, baby, all the time. I know sometimes you get mad. Yes, but it's not at you. It's at life and the circumstances we're in sometimes. I get angry at myself for not giving you all what you guys deserve. I want you guys to be happy. Mama, it's okay. I know you say that, but, but I know it's not. And I'm so sorry. Forgive me? I forgive you. For putting you in that situation? Yeah. You too, Kenny? Mama, you did what you had to do for us. And I get that. Do you get it, Lynn? She gets it. He explained it to me. <laughs> OK. OK, good. But I want you guys to hear from me first, or just hear it from me. I love you, and nothing will ever change that. So we can stay here? Yes. Yes, baby. We're staying here. We are staying here. So I can unpack? You already did. Not everything. What did you unpack? My heart. <laughs> That's so sappy, man. And I will take it. I won't. Come yeah, here. you will. Okay. okay. Things are going to be so much better. You'll see. I love you.
love you guys so much. <laughs>